Hi, I'm Hillary Shine ringing in a new year of good news, Killeen. It's 2021 and I think we're all hoping for a better year than last. We're off to a bumpy start, but let's resolve to turn things around together. The city of Killeen started the new year on a very sad note. Councilman Jim Kilpatrick passed away January 5th following his wife Judy's passing in December. Our condolences go out to the entire Kilpatrick family during this very sad time. Councilman Kilpatrick was elected as the District 3 representative in 2015 and was re-elected to second and third terms. He also served as mayor pro tem from 2017 to 2019 and as a planning and zoning commissioner from 1996 to 2003. Prior to his municipal service, Mr. Kilpatrick was a soldier in the United States Army. He served two tours in Vietnam, earning numerous medals, including the Silver Star, two Bronze Stars, and the Army Commendation Medal with V device. Following his retirement from active duty at Fort Hood in 1986, he worked as a defense contractor and an Army civilian. Killeen was lucky to have Councilman Kilpatrick. Our community and country are better because of his dedicated service. Community service is a great way to honor the memory of Councilman Kilpatrick and to improve our community. We have all sorts of volunteer opportunities throughout the year and we want you on our team. We're currently recruiting coaches for our youth sports programs and volunteers for Killeen Animal Shelter but we always need help with events and community cleanup efforts. To get started, all you have to do is fill out the volunteer team packet online at killingtexas.gov slash rec. Youth baseball, softball, and t-ball are registering now. Boys and girls ages 4 to 15 will be placed on teams according to age divisions for league play in May and June. Registration is $50 per player through February 19th and is accepted online or at the Family Rec Center. The 2021 Syntex Race Series is calling all runners and walkers. The series consists of 17 races throughout the area, including Killeen, Temple, Coppers Cove, and even Lampasas. The next race is in Coppers Cove. It's the virtual 5K run to the Polar Bear Plunge, January 23rd through 31st. Run your way across Central Texas this year to compete or complete. Check out the schedule and more details at killingtexas.gov slash Syntex. City offices will be closed Monday to honor Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Emergency services will continue without interruption. Trash collection will be on its normal schedule, but the transfer station and recycling center will be closed. Recycling trailers are still available. The Family Rec Center will be open from 5 a.m. to 5 p.m., but libraries and the animal shelter will be closed. For New Year news, check us out at KillingTexas.gov, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube, and tune in at Spectrum Cable Channel 10. May 2021 be full of good news, Killing.